Hi there, this is Darren O'Neill from Darren's Tech Tutorials and DarrenO'Neill.eu. In this very short video, I'm going to show you how to host a website on Amazon S3. So this will just be a static website, and that's all you can really host on S3. But it's incredibly cheap uh, to host a static website and very easy to do. So what I'm going to show you here really quick is I have two files. I have one called index.html, and I just have hello and welcome to my S3 website. And I have an error.html, and this is, oh no, we have an error. I'll leave a link to where you can pull down these two files if you're just doing this for testing so you can follow follow along. Okay, so let me minimize this. So I'm signed into uh, my Amazon console here. So I'm just going to click on S3. And what I'm going to do once this loads up, I'm going to create a new bucket. And I'm just going to call it Don S3 Website. Now just bear in mind that um, the bucket names are globally unique, so you need to have one that's globally unique. So I'm just going to click create here. Oh, and look, mine already exists. So let me call it one and try this. Okay, cool. So here we go. We have Don S3 website one. So let me just uh, click the checkbox here. And I'm going to come up to edit public access. I'm going to leave all these unticked. I'm going to click save. And I'm just going to type in confirm to confirm that I want to make this public. Let me close this out of the way here. Perfect, so let me go into our website here. I'm going to click Upload. And I'm going to click to Add Files. And I'm going to add my error and my index.html. And I'm going to click Upload. Okay, so we have our index.html and our error.html. So let me just select both of these. I'm going to click Actions. And I'm going to click to Make Public. And I'm going to click Make Public. And now that's that part of it done. So I'm going to then come up, I'm going to click on properties. I want to see where it says static website hosting. I'm going to click here and I'm going to click use this bucket to host a website. And it's going to prompt me for an index document and an error document. So let me just put in index.html and let me put in error.html matching the two files that we have there. And let me click save. Perfect. So let me just click on our static website hosting. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy this endpoint here. So let me just copy this. Okay, and let me just drag across a Firefox window that I have here so you guys can see. And I'm just going to paste and go. And there we go. And that's all there really is to it. It says, hello and welcome to my S3 website. So you can see how easily and quickly you can make a website on S3. It's really good for static hosting, incredibly cheap. Um, if you had a custom URL, you could just use DNS rules to point, uh, create a C name to point to this URL. Um, hopefully you found this video useful, and if you did, please do like and subscribe. And if you had any pr trouble following along, just comment below, and if I can help, I certainly will. And thank you for watching.